Hey guys, so I'm back. Uh, if you noticed that I was gone, I was on vacation for the past like 10 days or so. And um, I went to Las Vegas, Disneyland in California, Universal Studios in California, and SeaWorld in San Diego, California. And today I'm just going to do a haul of items that I bought while I was in Disneyland. And most of the items are Haunted Mansion because that is my favorite attraction there. I just love everything about it. I have an issue like every time I go there I just I buy and buy and buy and buy and stuff. So I wanted to see Disneyland because I had never been there before. I've been to Disney World a few times and the Haunted Mansion there is my favorite att attraction like I said and I had never seen the Haunted Mansion in Disneyland and I just wanted to see what the differences were between the two and it was kind of a bummer. I mean it was cool but it was kind of a bummer at the same time. They decorated the Haunted Mansion in Disneyland for Halloween time with a Jack Skellington like Nightmare Before Christmas theme. It was supposed to be like Jack Skellington and, and his crew like took over the Haunted Mansion and redecorated everything and it was really cool because I love Nightmare Before Christmas but I just wanted to see what the ride looks like every other time. You know, you know what I'm saying? So it was cool and it, and it was kind of a bummer at the same time. But anyways, I still enjoy myself and here are some items that I purchased. So first of all, you can see on my head, I have my Mickey ears and these ones were um, specially themed for Halloween and the um, Haunted Mansion for Jack Skellington. And it has little Jack Skellington face here, his um, trademark black and white stripes the ears with uh, black lace over it, and two black feathers coming out the top. I love these. As soon as I saw them, I was like, mine. I have to have them. So <laughs> they're going to be added to my collection. And then the next thing I got was this Mickey in a like vampire outfit. He has, I'm sorry, I didn't take the tags off yet. He has like a cape and a cute little outfit and he has cute little fangs. So anyways, the next thing I got was, uh, it's a Haunted Mansion character. He's one of the um, hitchhiking ghosts. There's three of them total. And I I didn't get all three, they're, they're not, I mean, stuff there is obviously not cheap, like it's Disney themed, so it's gonna be expensive. But I don't know, he's just like this little beanie stuffed thing like worm looking I just thought he was so cute and I had to have him so I only got the one little hitchhiking ghost. I showed you in one of my other uh, is my Disney World um, I think Magic Kingdom haul video I got a stuffed bear there it's supposed to be Mickey Mouse's bear his name is Duffy and I bought an outfit for him because he's my baby and it's the same outfit that Mickey has on but for him with the cape and everything his little tail sticking out the backside so now my baby can be dressed up for Halloween then when I was in line checking out I just saw uh, my cute cute little pin it's for Halloween it's uh, Mickey Mouse dressed up as a ghost so I got that so like I said it was all Halloween themed because they had the Halloween celebration going on and we participated in Mickey's Halloween party. It's like you go around um, to different locations and they give you candy and like, like you're trick-or-treating basically. That's what it is. And we got like shit loads of candy and I think I like ate most of it already and I think I've gained like, like 10 pounds since I've been away because it was just junk like every single day. So, but yeah, it was cool to go to the Halloween party. Um, I wanted to dress up but it was just too much of a pain to like leave the park and go back and put a Halloween costume on and do it all up and stuff like that. So I just, I didn't do it. It was a nuisance. But during the Halloween party, they had villains out, which they normally don't have out during any other time of the year, except for Halloween. So you could meet some of the villains. And I met my idol, Maleficent. She was there. I almost shit myself because I thought I was going to miss seeing her. I got in line. They're like, Malefic Maleficent left. I'm like, what the fuck? They were like, oh, but she's going to come back in like an hour. I'm like, okay, good. So I finally got to meet her and I think I walked up to her and I was like, you're my favorite. And she was like, I'm everybody's favorite. And I was like, good comeback. And then we got our pictures taken 
which I'll show you. And then when I was leaving, I was like, thank you. And she's like, the pleasure is all yours. Serve me well. I just thought that was so cool that she said all that stuff. So anyways, I know I'm, an, I'm a nerd. But getting back to the things that I got, I got a sweatshirt. Now this is the, I believe he's called the Top Hat Ghost. And he's only from the um, Disneyland locations, Haunted Mansion. He's not in Disney World. And I guess um, they had him out originally in the Haunted Mansion as like, you know, uh, display or whatever, like a ghost that scares you when you go through. And then they got rid of him for a while and then they just brought him back. So I saw him in the Haunted Mansion when we were there. And then on the back it says, a ghost will follow you home. So I thought that was cute because it got cold at nighttime. So I had to buy a sweatshirt. It was like an excuse to buy a sweatshirt. So... And then last but not least, I bought this dress. I'll get up and show you guys. It's modeled after what uh, the staff wears that works for the Haunted Mansion. It's supposed to be kind of like a maid's type of uniform. Um, I don't know, like a servant that works at the Haunted Mansion. And it's like this really cute like dress. Um, and I will show you. <laughs> for me today guys I hope you enjoyed this haul video let me know if you have been to the Haunted Mansion in Disneyland and what your th thoughts are on that and um, in comparison to maybe to the one in Disney World if, if you've done both um, I would have to say the one in Disney World is better because I think it has more things to it and the outside of the castle the outside of it is a castle as opposed to like a like an old like school like fashioned home I guess like Disneyland, it's like a, I don't know, almost like one of those plantation-like big homes. And um, the one in Disney World is like a big castle. So anyways, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. I, re I would really appreciate it. And it's good to see you guys again. And I will be hopefully doing a bunch more videos to catch up since I've been gone, if you've noticed that I was even gone anyway. So... <laughs> Until next time, stay dark, my friends, and I will talk to you later.